C'est un ambassadeur de la culture camerounaise au pays. Oui, il s'appelle James BKS. James BKS. To be honest, I couldn't picture myself on stage performing at first, let alone take the mic and sing and rap my lyrics. I've composed and written so much for others and been surrounded by such good musicians for so many years that had, and still have to be honest, an imposter complex. But at some point, when it comes to your story, your life, nobody can tell it better than you. And uh, I was in between positions that just couldn't work. My people, like Idris, Sofly, Cecilia, and a lot of people close to me actually were telling me that I had to take the plunge. I had to face the fact that nobody would do it for me. And uh, I remember my first performance as if it was yesterday. We managed to get a small gig at uh, La Petite Halle in Paris and I uh, had like not even a month, like a full month to work and put together a band. And that night my dad came through. And mind you, he happened to be a music legend, so imagine performing in front of a monument the very first time you get to hit the stage. It's insane. And the first problem is that it exists already. Et qu'il a envie de faire de la scène après avoir fait beaucoup, beaucoup de studios. Ça, c'est une étape importante pour lui aujourd'hui, hein, parce que c'est la première fois qu'il s'adresse quand même à un public directement. Donc, c'est important. Et plus il fera ça, plus euh, il va élaguer, forcément, et plus il trouvera sa personnalité va se préciser au fur et à mesure. Fortunately, we did all right. You know, I had a wonderful team around me that gassed me up and lift me to this day. And uh, I said to myself, if I can perform in front of my dad without choking, and sky is the limit. And from that moment on, I never wanted to look back. We celebrate blessings. I'm feeling myself. I did it myself. I'm feeling like flexing.